this Saturday's election day, it's runoff election across the state. Now, the man in charge of Louisiana's election is Secretary of State Carl Ardwan, and he's here. He's also running one of those races. First of all, let's put your acting Secretary of State hat on. And what are you seeing across the state as far as election-wise, as far as early vote totals in the election? Well, we have low turnout, as uh, we expected, because it's a quiet runoff. Um, we certainly hope more people come out to vote on Election Day, which is this Saturday, December 8th. But uh, it's been a low turnout thus far. So is that something that is typically a situation when you have these situations, like kind of late in the year, things like this? Yes, yeah. And I think that's something we need to work towards of getting away from the December election um, so that we can increase turnout. Um, because we saw almost 50%, if not more than 50% turnout in this last round, and now we're, we're looking at somewhere between 13 to 20%. Because smaller number of races. Right, smaller number of races, although, you know, Secretary of State's a statewide race, mm -hmm. it's just not a whole lot of interest in mm -hmm. that office, unfortunately, even though it's in charge of elections. <laughs> <laughs> and that's not so good news for you. No. Now, speaking of the election, you are running to keep that job. So tell us why the uh, voters in the state of Louisiana should vote for you. Well, sure, uh, experience. Um, I'm the only candidate in this race that has the amount of experience dealing with cybersecurity issues, securing the vote, dealing with uh, elections directly uh, and certainly feel like I'm the guy to keep in order to continue that process and keep our elections secure. Um, you know, prevent things like same-day voter registration or um, uh, automatic voter registration, things like that. Battles have already fought in the legislature. Experience is so important right now. We don't want to be another Broward County. No. Uh, oh, and, we don't want to. Right. And so <laughs> that's, that's why I'm offering myself to the people. So if there's anything else that you would say to help voters pick you, what would it be? What's the the one thing that you think basically that our voters need to know about you as the Secretary of State, not acting, but what you'll do in office? Oh, I'm going to continue securing our elections. I'm going to fight for new voting equipment uh, to update uh, that secure component of a, uh, a paper um, uh, uh, um, extra counting system mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, for auditing um, and, and thus such. That way people have a security as to how their vote was cast. So you can do it electronically and by paper. Uh, I'll continue to have the integrity of the office uh, at the forefront. Um, and again, experience. Uh, there's no trade for experience given the election systems that we're in now. Okay. Mr. Ardwan, thank you so much for coming in. We greatly appreciate it. Thank Our you. viewers yes. appreciate it as well. And, of course, a reminder that Election Day is Saturday, December the 8th. Many of you also have runoff elections for mayors, school boards, and other offices. Now, polls will open from 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. You'll be able to get your election results Saturday night on the website, myarchonist.com. So make sure you join us then.